It's the number 14 Mountaineers of West Virginia and the seventh ranked Red Raiders of Texas Tech. West Virginia in the road Navy. Sean McNeil in the starting lineup. Here's McClung, corner three, and the Red Raiders are on the board. Good feed to a cutting culver. They are establishing Ooh. the big man early. Without Oscar Shibway on the team, it's opened up so, more, so much more, like you said. Jalen Bridges is a guy who's taken advantage of that time as McNeil fires and hits a three. It's been that kind of a year. Who knew, though? I mean, if, if David McCormick keeps playing like Lou Alcindor, I mean, who knew that was going to happen? He'll try a three. Mac McClung has given the Red Raiders their first lead of the game. But Chris Beard told us, you know, people question the fit. I mean, are you even surprised at just how well this marriage has worked? Try to extend this three-point lead. McNeil, open look again. Mm. Sean McNeil is feeling it. He's five of five. And a turnover by Johnson. Open floor all the way to the basket. It's Kyler Edwards. And, you know, Bob Huggins decided to sit him with two, two fouls the rest of that half, it, you know, largely in part because they're up six. Deuce McBride is coming out firing. Here's McNeil, an open three, and he buries it. McNeil got the start in this one, and he leads all scores with 18 points. Edwards all the way to the rim. Avery Benson in the game for the first time for Texas Tech. Open look for McClung. Rattles around the rim and goes down. You know, a stat, Chris, in preparing for this game that stood out to me as Edwards misfires on the three. Second effort by T.J. Shannon. And some electricity in Lubbock. Nice Good clutch. backdoor cut. And the basket by Deuce McBride. Nice feed. Well, again, it speaks to the depth and talent on this West Virginia team that they've been over to, able to overcome mm. a couple of... PV goes to work, and he's double-teamed again. McClung fires a three, and it goes down. Here's McClung. Strong to the basket, and it gives the Red Raiders the lead. McBride mm. fires a three, and he connects. McBride gives it up. Here's a three for Bridges, and it goes down. Down to two on the shot clock. McNeil fires and hits. Look at Culver fight for position down low. They find him in an opportunity for a three-point play. McClung. Here Shannon fires the three, and he knocks it down. Fittingly, Sean McNeil is going to dribble out the clock in what's been a career night for him. And how about the road victory for West Virginia coming to Lubbock and knocking off the number seven team in America? 82-71.